Good morning, dear children. In the previous class, we have learned about countable noun and uncountable noun. I hope it was easy for you to understand. And today, we are going to learn a new lesson, singular and plural. First, understand what is singular and plural. Singular means single one, only one. That is called single. We call it as singular. And a plural, if we have more than one, it could be two, three, four, or more than that. That is called plural. So, on first understand what is single and plural. Single means one, and a plural means more than one. Right? First understand that. And today we are going to learn regarding singular and plural with some of the exercises. So, here we go. Singular means one. As I said, single means, singular means only one. That is called single. Plural means more than one. Here we have some exercises, I mean some examples. Singular and plural. Toy. Toy. Here we have toys. You know what is the meaning of toys, right? Which we use to play with. So mostly girls used to play, right? right. Bus. We have only one bus. Here, singular means they indicate only one. They say toy. It indicates, it shows only one toy. Here, bus means bus. They say only one bus. And here, baby, only one baby. Leaf. Leaf means only one leaf, which we have on the tree. It's called leaf. Right? They say, it means toy, bus, baby, leaf. Everything means only one. One toy, one bus, one baby, and one leaf. That's why we say here, singular. But the same way, when we speak about plural, toy, she toys. Bus, buses. Baby, babies. Leaf, leaves. Just see both boxes, singular and plural. What is the difference? What makes singular and plural as a difference? Spelling. This is the spelling T O Y. T O Y. Toy. Singular. Plural. T O Y. O, Y, and they are with yes, with the toy, they are yes, so it becomes plural form, as which means more than one. The singular, they say toy, toy means one. When they are yes, it becomes plural, more than one toys. By adding yes, the word becomes. Plural, more than one. Just see the second one, bus. B U S, bus. And with bus, B U S, they are E S. They are simply E S to make plural. To make plural form, they are E S. The same way you see here, baby, B A B Y, baby. Here, B A B. I E S B A B I E S. So something is missing. What is missing? Y. They removed Y and they have added I E S. Babies. And the last leaf. L E A F. Leaf. Again. L E A V E S. L E A V E S. To make this a plural. Now observe clearly. Toy. They are yes to make it plural. Bus B U S and they are something extra. First they are added yes and again they are E S E S buses and the next one baby they removed Y. They removed Y. 
and they added IES instead of Y they have added IES the last leaf they removed it yes instead of yes they have added VES Y sir so in English grammar we have such a rules and regulations to make a plural form so those rules and regulations we will learn step by step in upcoming slides or upcoming classes so first understand how we have to differentiate singular and plural so why they have added here yes and why they have added here es and why ies and why ves there's a rule in english grammar we have that we will learn it later but first differentiate first learn how to differentiate singular and plural right here we have some exercises which will make us and which will help us to make singular form into plural form here we have add yes to each word to form the plural read it again add yes to each word to form the plural right he we here we have almost 20 words here already we have 20 words what we are going to do we are going to simply add yes to make it as plural right we are going to add simply add yes to make all these 20 words into plural what is first one arm a r m a r m arm what we supposed to do we supposed to add yes a r m yes arms so which is given here or every singular form what we are trying to do is we are making the singular form into plural form right here it is arms we have added yes simply add with a word we have added yes to make us plural simple very easy right the next one i i means we say only one i to say both eyes we have to add yes in the word we don't remove anything we add simply yes with the word right the next one kite to make it plural we have to add kites yes we have to add to make it as a plural kites the next one vowels vowels we are the next one tree t r e e s s double s right simply we have added yes for making it as a plural the same way here bird birds fans lines pens umbrellas and here we have clock gun map rat village as singular form here everything indicates only one one clock one gun one map one rat one village after adding here yes it becomes clocks more than one it could be two three four ten thousand crow could be anything after adding yes same way gun here guns becomes more than one rats mass villages everything becomes plural form in the last same way door jar nest ship window everything is there in singular form and after adding it begins plural of doors, judge, nest, ships and widows it becomes plural form right dear children remember in this form we don't remove anything in this given words we don't remove anything simply we have added yes with all these words see here clock C O C K C O C K but we have added yes so it becomes plural right yeah so next we are going to see the next exercise we are going to add ES we are going to add ES to make a plural form right bus buses right 
glass glasses glasses bench benches brush brushes sorry bush bushes gas gas gases dish dishes coach coaches church churches see me we have the i all the words with e s at last we are i e s for all these words to make it as a plural form to make it as a plural form we have to add simply e s simply e s to make it as a plural form dear children this exercise 3 is very easy read that change y to i and add e s now what we are going to do is so in all the word it is given y in nfs word see that army y diary y duty y baby y lady y fly y so in all the words the word is ending with y the word is ending with y remember when a verb, when a noun, all these are called noun, right? When the noun ends with y. When a verb ends with y, we have to remove y. We have to remove y and we have to add i and then es. See here, our name. It is in singular form. Now, singular form. Army. So, what I have done here? I have removed Y. I removed Y. Instead of Y, I have added I. Instead of Y, I have added I E S. I E S. Simple. Simply. If a noun ends with y, end of the ends with y, remove y, then add is. So it becomes plural form. So it becomes plural form. It's very simple. When a word begins or when a word ends with y, remove y and then add is to make a plural form. Here everything is given singular form. Army, only one army. Diary, only one diary. Duty, only one duty. Baby, only one baby. Here after adding IES, it becomes plural form. It becomes plural form. See, diaries. I removed Y, then I have added IES. The same way, duties. Babies, I have removed Y, added IES to make it as plural form. Lady, ladies. Remove Y, then I have added IES, flies, the same with copies, so single copy, only one copy, and this is copies, plural form, maybe more than one copies, libraries, country, stories, stories, this is more than one story, it could be more than maybe two, three, four, but not one. Here everything is only one story. I mean only one. Singular. Only one. What is given here? Everything is more than one. Which means plural. More than one, which is plural. Then yes, dear children. Remember. Remember today we have started with not singular and plural. Remember only one. Singular means single, only one. Plural means more than one. Today, this is sufficient for you. Please learn this one. What is singular and what is plural? Just understand. Singular means only one. Yeah, only one. Plural means 
more than one. It could be, it can be two, three, four, five, and uh, there could be more, hundred, thousand, one lakh, could be. Everything called a plural. But singular means only one. Remember that. So the remaining exercises we will see tomorrow with the rules and regulations. I will tell you why it is being changed every in the upcoming video. Please don't miss the class. Learn, watch line by line. Please try to understand and what is try to understand what is singular and what is plural. Thank you, dear children.